Hello everyone, and welcome back to Nurse Quiz Corner. Today, we've got another set of questions to test your knowledge on the nervous system. Think you've got what it takes? Make sure to grab a pen and paper, and keep track of how many you get right. Don't forget to share your score in the comments below, and let us know how you did. Ready? Here are the answers and rationales for each question. 1. What are the three specific functions of the nervous system? A. Sensory input, integration, peripheral interpretation. B. Sensory input, integration, peripheral and voluntary input. C. Integration, sensory input, motor output. D. Motor output, peripheral interpretation, voluntary input. Correct answer. C. Integration, sensory input, motor output. Rationale. The nervous system processes sensory information, input, integrates that information in the CNS, and then sends out motor commands, output, to execute a response. 2. The central nervous system, CNS, includes the A. Brain and cranial nerves B. Brain and spinal cord C. Cranial and spinal nerves D. Spinal cord and spinal nerves Correct answer B. Brain and spinal cord Rationale the CNS is composed of the brain and spinal cord, which are responsible for processing information and coordinating bodily functions. 3. The peripheral nervous system, PNS, includes the A. Brain and cranial nerves B. Brain and spinal cord C. Cranial and spinal nerves D. Spinal cord and spinal nerves Correct answer C. Cranial and spinal nerves Rationale the PNS includes all the nerves outside the CNS, including cranial and spinal nerves, which connect the CNS to the rest of the body. 4. The afferent division of the nervous system functions in A. Integrative activities B. Motor output C. Sensory input D. Integrative functions, motor control, and sensory input Correct answer C. Sensory input Rationale, the afferent, sensory, division transmits sensory information from receptors to the CNS for processing. 5. Identify the three basic parts of a neuron. A. Axon, cell body, and dendrite. B. Axon, dendrite, and myelin. C. Cell body, dendrite, and myelin. D. Cell body, dendrite, and neuroglia. Correct answer. A. Axon, cell body, and dendrite. Rationale. A neuron consists of three primary parts. Dendrites, receive signals, the cell body, soma, and the axon, transmit signals. 6. A neuron that transmits nerve impulses from the central nervous system to muscles, glands, and other organs is A, N, A, interneuron, B, motor neuron, C, Sensory neuron. D. Unipolar neuron. Correct answer. B. Motor neuron. Rationale. Motor neurons carry signals from the CNS to muscles, glands, and organs to elicit a response. 7. Neurons that transmit nerve impulses from receptors to the central nervous system. Gore neurons. A. Interneuron. B. Motor neuron. C. Sensory neuron. D. Unipolar neuron. Correct answer. C. Sensory neuron. Rationale. Sensory neurons transmit signals from sensory receptors to the CNS for processing. 8. The nucleus of a neuron is associated with the of the neuron. A. Axon. B. Cell body. C. Dendrite. D. Myelin sheath. Correct answer. B. Cell body. Rationale. The nucleus is located in the cell body, soma, of the neuron and is responsible for the cell's activities. 9. The gaps in between the myelin sheath are called A. Axon B. Cell body C. Dendrite D. Node of Ranvier Correct answer. D. Node of Ranvier Rationale The nodes of Ranvier are gaps between segments of myelin that allow the rapid transmission of electrical signals. 10. A bundle of axons in the central nervous system is A. A. Cell body. B. Nerve. C. 
Neuroglia. D. Tract. Correct answer. D. Tract. Rationale. In the CNS, a bundle of axons is called a tract, whereas in the PNS it is called a nerve. 11. A bundle of axons in the peripheral nervous system is A. A. Cell body. B. Nerve. C. Neuroglia. D. Tract. Correct answer. B. Nerve. Rationale. In the PNS, bundles of axons are referred to as nerves, while in the CNS they are called tracts. 12. Chemical messengers that allow neurons to communicate with other cells are called A. Axons B. Myelin C. Neurotransmitters D. Neuroglia Correct answer C. Neurotransmitters Rationale Neurotransmitters are chemicals that transmit signals across synapses, allowing communication between neurons and other cells. 13. What are the cells that support and nourish neurons? A. Dendrites B. Axons C. Neurotransmitters D. Neuroglia Correct answer D. Neuroglia Rationale Neuroglia, or glial cells, are non-neuronal cells that provide support, protection, and nourishment for neurons. 14. The myelin sheath around axons in the CNS is formed by A. Schwann cells B. Neurons C. Oligodendrocytes D. None of the above 15. Identify a classification of neurons by structure A. Interneuron B. Motor neuron C. Unipolar neuron D. Sensory neuron Correct answer C. Unipolar neuron Rationale Neurons can be classified by structure into unipolar, bipolar, and multipolar neurons based on the number and arrangement of processes extending from the cell body. 16. Identify a neurons that have a multipolar structure. A. Sensory. B. Motor. C. Interneuron. D. Both B and C are correct. Correct answer. D. Both B and C are correct. Rationale. Both motor neurons and interneurons are multipolar meaning they have one axon and multiple dendrites. 17. Which of the following is not true of the resting potential of a neuron? A. The membrane is polarized. B. The outside is positively charged. C. The inside has an abundance of sodium ions. D. The inside is negatively charged. Correct answer. C. The inside has an abundance of sodium ions. Rationale. At resting potential, the inside of the neuron has more potassium ions, while sodium ions are more abundant outside the cell. 18. What mechanism helps keep the neuron membrane at its resting potential? A. Passive diffusion of ions. B. Active transport sodium-potassium pump. C. Filtration of ions. D. Pinocytosis of ions. Correct answer. B. Active transport sodium-potassium pump. Rationale. The sodium-potassium pump actively moves sodium out of the neuron and potassium into the neuron to maintain the resting potential. 19. In the comment session, let me know how many you scored. Check out for part three. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.